working properly and then went to go play his game. <laughs> Thanks for being fine. Good old Fumo. And he does go to the blaze again. The two fire starters here. Mm -hmm. so, fire, fire. So you've seen this matchup a little bit more here in the last couple of weeks. What usually goes on with them? Uh, I mean, I feel like I feel like Wakanda puts a really good zoning mm -hmm. defense up, and that really works in his favor so far. So I'm yeah. happy to see. Yeah, Blaziken doesn't have a lot of options to really get past zoning. He does have the Tatsu, which is like the wind, the wind tornado, the back Y. And it does delete some projectiles, but only once the start of tapping. We saw him try to do it there. So you start up not getting there in time, going straight into dual phase. It's also a very untraditional start for Picano, mm -hmm. actually. See, that is punishable, and he kind of able to punish accordingly. Pushing Fumu back. He's kind of trying to call something out the 8Y. Plus on the guard. White screen trading with the 2Y for Fumu. It's going to eliminate the frog deer because of the phase shift points. See, oh, and golfing. Goodness. <laughs> Ooh, just from up in the heavens. See, it looks like Pecano's actually studied a little bit, which is kind of very un uncharacteristic of Pecano. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but he's doing a lot of options, say, really throwing out those eight Ys to prevent Fumu from going in with the Blaze Kicks. Well, he wouldn't gain onto the ground. He would not have got caught by that Molga, but he tried to cancel up. Relentless. Nice AY there from Picano. See, if he didn't have much of an option, the only thing he could have really done is tried to absorb those projectiles with, a, with his counter attack, and then my god, enough burst uh, to try to overrun Picano towards the end. That same that start, actually, there. Mm -hmm. Why anyway, coming out? I like what I'm seeing from Bracano, he has really adopted the zoning style. He knows that this is what he's going to do. Yeah, I'd say he has control over the match right now. You can even see a couple really almost desperate uh, dive kicks down from Fumu trying to get something started. And this might be it, right into the corner. Goes for the grab. So I don't necessarily agree with that. He does get the crit and a little bit of wall damage, but I just like to keep him in the corner, especially since Bracano has really uh, been doing super well in this matchup. Isn't it? Oh, Blaziken, your hitboxes. Pushes him towards the corner. Tries to five white, not able to get it. Okay. Nice side swap from Picano, and able to knock him out. Is this going to be it? It is. Oh, my goodness. Great stuff coming out from Picano. I'm really liking this Blaziken. Or this uh, Brakes. This Blaze Brakes. Blaze Brakes. Oh, so cute. <laughs> she has thumbs. I didn't see them. Is Brakes enough thumbs? It's a paw, you know. Oh. Paw. Okay. <laughs> that makes sense. <laughs> well, like, how does she how does she grip the broom? But like she like kind of like puts her old arm around it. She has magic. Ah, that too. Mm -hmm. That must be it. <laughs> <laughs> right, a little bit longer on the please wait screen, so we might be seeing something from our change from Fumu. Yeah, we do. Yeah, repping the bird. <laughs> see, we all know I like to see this. <laughs> see, we'll see if Picano keeps with the same style, because also, kind of like Blaziken, the situation likes to be in the air quite a bit. So we'll see if he uses those eight Ys to really kind of keep out, to keep him out, have that no zone. Good I, response. I like the zoning test by Picano, but Fumo able to get through him. Frezzy Blaine. <laughs> Right from the grab, going for the recovery frames. Not close enough for the wall, though. Not close enough for the Oki either. Just, yeah, really outspacing those. Maybe so, uh, thinking of Blaziken reach. Possibly. Going for them out of the air. Tries for the grab, kind of reading it and going for the JX and field. able to confirm on the combo here. Looks like he is. Just missing the wall again, though. Okay. 
trying to burst up, see if he can finish it here. Not able to before Bur before Pecano gets burst. Did he press the button? He did not. Shooting the Magnemites. <laughs> Just great pressure, and this does 10 shit for each one. Mm -hmm. And then it's exactly what Fumu was looking for. See, Fumu really adopted oh, that strategy. That reach. Mm -hmm. that reach is crazy. And it's plus four, no matter where you hit. <laughs> yeah, that's exactly what Fumu's looking for. He's done that since Sidewise dropped. He's just sat there and poked you with those Magnemites for those 10, H, uh, 10 HP chip. Mm -hmm. Waits for you to get frustrated and try to CA it, and then go straight to the first. Smart. Medicaid coming out. Able to punish. Good response there. Just missed spacing the light screen, though. Cross up pushes him back. For oh my gosh! <laughs> Just do it! <laughs> Fumu getting caught pressing some buttons here. But he's in now. Mm -hmm. There it is. Good combo starter. Doesn't shift him. But now Picano is resetting the phase shift points. Oh, just oh. barely reached. That's a good punish. Nice falling through move. Actually locks out the Fennekin too, going into field. Kind of putting that pressure on. Faking for the grab and actually goes for the burst, but Fumu not falling for it. He's getting that shit though. Mm -hmm. Alright, can Fumu punish this? Uh, there are actually a few frames in Fennekin. If you timed it exactly right, your iframes would go past the Fennekin iframes and you would punish with your burst. Kind of sitting on game point here. <laughs> and he's going to hit the Molga out. No recovery on that JX. Sylveon coming out. Isn't going to get tagged. I like the attempt there from Fumu, kind of maybe anticipating that AY that the comet has been throwing out a lot more. forward wire there from Fumu to close the gap a little bit here. He just wanted to get in and then oh, went right back out as well. Now I'll try for the grab account or uh, Fumu not having it. Nice back dash. Oh, but yeah, I think he's gonna get caught here with the burst. He is. Psy Firecracker. Super kawaii. <laughs> Fumu trying for the forward and gets punished by the Emolga and then gets punished on the fire blast pushes him back on the wall now Picano is sitting on match point here Fumu needs to make something happen tries gets it can he confirm for the kill here uh, I don't think enough air techs out of it last hit situation Nice. Able to snag mm, it right at the end. Right there, that was not looking good. No. <laughs> but Fumu uh, clutching it out, going into game number three here against Picano. Now, see if you see any support changes. I really doubt it. Uh, Picano is really liking that, and Mulga and Invor is working pretty well for him. I don't think I've ever seen him utilize any of his supports, actually. No, I think he's really stuck on that Fennekin and Mulga. But it makes well, well use out of them, so mm -hmm. can't be mad about it. What's really nice about Bacano, and almost a little bit different, is that he uses a very offensive Fennekin, where most players see Fennekin like, as a get-out-of-jail-free card. Right. Of, like, whenever I'm in pressure, I'm going to pop this, and they're going to get away from me. He runs up and does it in your face. <laughs> <laughs> so... I like this zoning again, kind of reminiscent of the first game, but kind of trying to take a more uh, step towards that. Collecting all these synergy nuggets, nuggets and keeping in uh, the middle of the field. 
trying to get some stage control there, but Fumu able getting stage control of his own and pushing towards the wall. Does he punish? He does. Ooh, it's a grab. But Kano getting his own punish though. That goes really high. Rowdy. Thanks for having me, guys. Goodbye. <laughs> Falco's hopping off the match. We got Sorry Tag coming in here on the game Yarn. number three. Yarn. Sorry. Yeah, games. We got to play. Anyway, what is going on here? Things are happening. So game three. Says round zero. Okay. He's just flying back down. Now he's going to shield break. Get that shield pressure on. He's just floating above him. He's got to be able to get out of that. <laughs> I like the attempt from Fumu. He actually mitigated the damage. There's no way he, he there's no way he could really get out of that. So he mitigated the damage. But McConnell able to go in there. Oh, yeah. That pressure was insane. Mm -hmm. That was insane on the See, there was only one dual phase in that entire round. Kano, was there really? But Kano really setting up the screen here in field. But Fumu trying uh, to mitigate that. Yep. Goes for the Oki plus four there. He's able to get countered by Kano. Going mm -hmm. into the ADX combo. Yep. See, offensive Emolga. And shield? No, he doesn't. Just straight for the combo. I love that so much. <laughs> spirit, setting up the Spirit Shackle. Such a tough trap to get out of mm -hmm. the field. Miss space. Oh, is this going to autocorrect? Yeah, I believe it's going to only to. It's going to, yeah, but he's <laughs> going to fly over it. <laughs> Just barely, too. I thought I thought he had already used it. All right. Going into the boomerang for the face change. Yep. Well, nice punish. Puts him up on the wall of 5YY. Yep, yep. Only able to get 5YY. No, no feel like, third Y. I feel like some 8X uh, spacing might, be, might work out for Boomer here, maybe. <laughs> Oh, just sniping him out of the air. Get down here, bird. I don't need, I don't need that bird yet. Oh! <laughs> forward dashes through it with the iframes and able to get to grab. It feels great, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. I feel, that always feels amazing. All right, going to the Spirit Shackle Traps again. Mm -hmm. He's able to get rid of one of them. A little poke. Connor's really spacing here with his forward Y. Oh, yeah. Setting up that wall again. Keep, keeping center field and just holding it. Back up only a little bit if you need to. Mm -hmm. He does have to only 10 seconds, so if Fumu does oh, have a life yeah. lead. I didn't notice the timer. See, if he's able to get one forward wide and then pop burst. <laughs> he just doesn't care. Uh Oh, he pops burst right. He has a health lead. Clash, that's it. That's a clash, yep. That was oh. really good. That was super <laughs> clever by Picano there. Picano able to take it. Both of them, that clash there, that wastes a ton of time. Oh, yeah. Picano able to take it. She does oh. not have thumbs, ladies and gentlemen. Bracing no does not have thumbs. Confirmed. Does not have thumbs. Poking hot take. Poking hot. None of the characters.